turn on the TV, there's the old pharmaceutical industry telling you how deeply concerned they are about your problems. Somebody should ask them if they're so concerned about your problems, why do they charge you 10 times more for some drugs than they charge in Canada? Will the big money interest in the pharmaceutical industry be allowed to win out, or will the will of the American people prevail? We're taking on some really tough birds who are extraordinarily greedy. Year after year, the pharmaceutical industry is the most profitable industry in America. They pay, in some cases, their CEOs tens of millions of dollars in compensation packages, but they just can't lower their prices for senior citizens in Vermont and this country. So it's an ongoing struggle. We have the momentum with us. They are on the defensive. Uh, but they own, I got to tell you, unfortunately, they own a lot of members of Congress, and we're not there yet. Well, I don't think they own you, Bernie. They do not own me. Believe <laughs> me. You should see some of the discussions that have taken place between them and me. No, they do not own no. me. The American people are saying enough is enough. We don't want the pharmaceutical industry to be ripping us off. If you think back and you know the tremendous fight that had to take place against the establishment and the moneyed interest to pass Medicare, to pass Medicaid, but we're up against it again. We're going to win this fight, if not next week or this year, in the coming years. Prescription drugs have got to be made available to our people at a reasonable price. Will the United States Congress respect the will of the people of this country and significantly lower the cost of prescription drugs? This is a huge issue and one of the major health care crises facing this country. The current outrageous situation is not going to continue, but it is just astounding to me to be in the middle of it and to see the incredible kinds of money uh, and political pressures that are being exerted in order to maintain these outrageously high prescription drug prices.